Hi, good day. I am your teacher, Carmi, and now we will discuss or talk about the GEMDAS or PEMDAS rule. Hello everyone, today we will state, explain, and interpret PEMDAS or GEMDAS rule. So, MDAS stands for multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Meaning, we perform the multiplication or division first before the addition and subtraction. Kung ano ang mauna multiplication or division, any of the two, and also addition or subtraction. How do you evaluate an expression with two different operations? You use the PEMDAS or GEMDAS rule. So again, what is PEMDAS or GEMDAS first? PEMDAS or GEMDAS stands for, it is an acronym for the word parenthesis, multiplication and division, addition and subtraction. So P stands for parenthesis. Given two or more operations in a single expression, the order of the letter in the PEMDAS or GEMDAS tells you what to calculate first, second, third, and so on, until the calculation is complete. G stands for group, grouping symbols. So what are the grouping symbols that we are going to use or in encounter in our given numbers? First is the parenthesis. So this is an example of a parenthesis, the open and close parenthesis. Next is the bracket and the braces. So here is the bracket and now this is the brace. So uunahin natin for ang nasa inside the parenthesis. Then either of the two kung ano yung mas nasa loob, yun yung uunahin natin isolve. Let us try this. 2 times 3 plus 4. So, is it MDAS, PEMDAS, or GEMDAS? Correct. So, this is MDAS. So, we will follow the MDAS rule since wala tayong grouping symbol. 2 times 3 plus 4. So, unahin natin ng times. 2 times 3 equals 6 plus 4. So, 6 plus 4 equals 10. Next. 7 times, open parenthesis, 9 minus 3, close parenthesis. By this time, we will use the PEMDAS rule since we have a parenthesis. Kahit may multiplication sign tayo doon, meron naman tayong parenthesis, we will perform the subtraction first. Ano mayayari sa 7? So, we will just copy 7 times. 9 minus 3 equals 6. So, 7 times 6. 7 times 6 equals 42. Next, example, 18 minus 12 divided by 2 plus 4. Again, we will follow the PEMDAS rule since meron tayong parenthesis sign. Ang mangyayari, we will just copy 18 and 4. So first, 12 divided by 2 equals 6. So, magiging 18 minus 6 plus 4. Following the MDAS rule, minus subtraction or addition, na una ang subtraction. So, first, 18 minus 6 equals 12. Then, 12 plus 4 equals 16. So, the answer is 16. Next example, bracket, open parenthesis, 2 times 90, close parenthesis, minus 54, close bracket, divided by 2. So, we will use the GEMDAS rule since we have a bracket sign in the parenthesis sign. So, what will become first? Unay natin ang inside the parenthesis. Matitira ang open close a bracket. 2 times 90 equals 180 minus 54 divided by 3. So, may natira pa tayong bracket sign. 
So, inside of division, unahin natin ang subtraction. So, 180 minus 54 equals 126 divided by 3. Now, wala na ang grouping symbols natin, then we can proceed the division sign. 126 divided by 3 equals 42. So, the answer is 42. I hope may natutunan kayo ngayong araw na to. So, for your assignment or your given exercises, you will write the steps or the preparations in solving given mathematical expressions of A and B. So, sulat na! Again, I am your teacher, Karmi, at huwag niyo yung kalilimutang mag-like at mag-subscribe sa aking YouTube channel. Bye!